everyone, welcome back! This is Dennis Jones with GameFusion.com, bringing you guys more Namco Cross Capcom, and yes, this is chapter 33, titled, I Will Not Lose Hope. And I finally got to the end of the chapter a couple days ago, and I finally got to be able to figure out the actual chapter name. Anyway, so here we are, Wodagon and Lilith. We're gonna have them go after this Red Army or Ace. Because we need them to level up, they're level 30, we need them to get some levels here. And this thing's almost dead, so let's take it out. Okay, so I believe they have a combo of just down and, and circle. But I, I like sometimes get it delving out of it. You know? Yeah, I don't think we got a branch up at that time, but we did get some... something. Uh, I don't know. We got two times experience, so maybe we did get a branch up, but I did not notice. It's possible! Alright. These little mage things. Oh my gosh. Okay, Reje and Jammu. It's time for them to do things, because we got we got the Black Bravo Man hanging out here, and his sidekick Amazona. We should do something to bring down her HP. She's wow, she's got quite a bit. Not just not as much as most of the bosses. I'm still creeped out by that little, that giant caterpillar dropping back and forth in the background. <laughs> but, uh, you know, it's, it's a thing that's on the stage, and I don't think, I don't think we really address what's going on with that giant caterpillar. But, uh, sure, it's just a part of the scenery, so it doesn't matter. 1900. Now, quite some time ago, I had written down most of these uh, characters' combos, at least the ones I could find on on the internet, and the only source I had for it, actually, <laughs> was a YouTube video where someone was performing these combos. And some are ranged, some are not. But, uh, and sometimes I end up doing it, and sometimes I don't. Valkyries is this one right here. The, we, we just go back and forth from doing left and down. But since we need some HP, I finished it off by finishing up the rest for attacks. And no level up. That's no fun. That's not good at all. But oh well. Okay, well we definitely want to go into defensive. I don't think these creatures can hurt us too much. But uh, I might still yet... ...heal myself. Although... I think I should save that. And I guess not. <laughs> Let's go on and go on to defensive. This creature's gonna hit us with a range attack, it looks like. Oh, it's hit us with ice! Ah! No! It's the frozen robot! We need frozen robot, let it go! Just let it go! Okay, that was a forced joke and I just came up with it. <laughs> And now it's Hideo and Kyoko. They're their turn to go into the fray, although there's nothing much for them to fight over here. I mean, there's stuff over there, and then there's those creatures that are all the way back here. With Red Army or Joker just watching. She's a dingus. Okay, Mr. Black Bravo Man. Going after the ladies, are you? Of course he would. Of course he would. 
しませてちょうだい刺激的に来て。Hitting him, hitting these ladies with his elastic arms and his elastic legs. Oh, Sable. <laughs> I actually don't like doing voiceover for him, even though I, I don't think I actually get it to the right spot of where it needs to be, but I automatic, I do love doing it at the same time. It's a love hate thing. Because, yeah, of course he's a rock star, so I think of other people like. Listen to. I don't know. And I also take in. Mostly I take inspiration from the Japanese voiceover that happens too. But, uh. Yeah, that's actually how I try to keep things here for any of the voices I try to do. At least, all the guy ones. It's kind of hard to do girl voices when you're a, a guy, so <laughs> I'm sure ev everyone knows. Yeah, go after the rice ball. Well, I figure it's easy. It's better to take a use up an item than it is to use a skill, on account, and this is the reason. If you were to kill an enemy. If you were to kill an enemy or get an item from an enemy, then you'd have a spot, a spot for it. Right there. And you can have it equipped right then if you get it. Think. And then if you have too many I hold items, then it just goes to your inventory. Yeah. So Stan and Ruti still don't have anything to fight. Taizuo! So finally, we can hit one of these. A、uh, QB. Okay. See. I think Taizuo is one of the only characters, or one of the few characters, that I do not have a branch combo for. <laughs> If any of you guys know a good branch combo for him, please let me know in the comments below. But I'll just keep using his, each and every one of his attacks. Who knows, maybe I have to learn it, but I never have not seen what it is yet. What makes his combo a thing?、Mm. Yeah, I think, I think we can reach them. Yes, we can. Alright, l let's get that QB out of here with Fong Ling and Rei Rei, and they're ranged. With their ranged thing, which I believe goes like this. Oh, we have two options actually. Rei Rei. We can either do. It always starts to the left, and either right or up. And I think I'm doing things wrong. <laughs> yeah. Oh well. It doesn't matter because I think we kill it in the end. Oh, never mind. We are so close to getting it. But okay. Well, we get a cherry. That's handy. More cubies attacking. More cubies! 
And of course, Zabel, going up against that big mass of people, chooses to go up against Valkyrie. You know, I really don't think I should use that rice ball. I have an empty slot. Um, let's counter it. Because we can. Why not? Probably shouldn't have let used up my SP though. Now ah, well. <laughs> but I like the look of that guy. Valkyrie just smacked his face into the dirt. Good job, Valkyrie. Alright, Strider. Well. No, I want you to attack something, Strider. Or as it's calling you, Hiru. Hiru? Hiru. Sure, I don't know. <laughs> That's how it is. Uh, huh. Let's use our max against him, actually. Because why not? It's one of the bosses, and I love saving the maxes for the bosses, so let's do it! No. By looking on my cheat sheet, it is left and zero three times, and finishes off with the which is circle. And we get our branch! So there we go. That's the branch out. <laughs> baby. Oh my goodness. Well, we got a level up and we learned a. No, no, no. We got an item of Magic Leap. We didn't learn any new move. I, like, I was hoping we might learn a move, but guess not. Alright. Morgan and Lilith are in trouble. Do I have anything that heals them? Heals their HP at all? I have stuff that could get rid of. MP, 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 and heal faint. <laughs> okay. Um. Dang it, I didn't mean to use that, but okay. Uh, I guess it. I guess it's fine. Okay, let's let's go in here and hope that we get an HP up for doing all of our attacks. But of course, I do want to get. But of course I do want to get at least one combo off. Oh, we can use a max! Let's go for it. Alright, let's finish up the other attacks. And hopefully we get ourselves an HP up! Yes! You know, all I see, it didn't heal us as much as I'd hoped, but at least we got some health. And we got two levels for our troubles, too. <laughs> Excellent. And we got Angel made for an equipment. Snazzy. Kandama Momo. I, I won't. And off she goes already. Amazona! Don't be hasty. We're almost there. We're almost at Dragas Tower. We will have our chance to save her. Don't worry. Correct. That demon's tower is close at hand. And to get there, we've got to clean up this mess. Uh, I know. We've got to get to the tower. Come on! So that was a short little cutscene. That always happens when we defeat an enemy, though, so that's kind of expected. Uh, Hiyahachi. Do you? What am I trying to look for? Covers. HP. 
but only on himself, and he has full health. So that doesn't help Lilith and Morrigan's situation. <laughs> I really need to find someone who has something to heal them up with. Um, yeah, let's go after Black Brown, though. I mean, we could go after Zavala as well, too, but... I'm not entirely sure my reasoning for going after him. <laughs> Maybe he was going next. I suppose. But I guess I really shouldn't go after the creatures that are going up having a turn come up soon because that makes... A level up, and we learned a new move. All right, well, as I was saying, it makes them go take their turn sooner, so it's just making them able to hit us. So maybe I should be going after the creatures that aren't going anytime soon. I guess it doesn't really matter, though. Oh, we got ourselves a boiled egg. Well, that helps our HP situation a wee bit. And let's go into the defense. Oh, of course, this... Phobos thing would be going after Morgan Lilith. They're such popular girls. Gee, I wonder why. <laughs> well, it's a good thing that Morgan's covering herself up for this attack against oh, a uh, blah, 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 robot, a Phobos. But all right then. <laughs> oh, Arthur, it is your turn. Let's move you. You really can't go very far, can you? All right. Um, let's have him join this fight here. No, it's gonna take him forever. All right. Let's get this QB. Yeah, let's put them there and. Ubi's going down. Let's get that battle going. And here we go! One final KO! Alright, let's save our SP for another creature. Probably a boss if we get to one. But yeah, this is Hideo's um, branch move. We just spam this one. We did get one branch up. We got, oh, we got damage up. We got special, or uh, whatever SP stands for. Well, look at that. Level up. We are doing great. Your thoughts, Morgan? The Soul Tribe. I too only know what I've heard. Supposedly, they only live in the lands of the Dormer House. Or of Dormer House. I put the the in there for no apparent reason. Jedha, the family head, disappeared and after that the clan was destroyed. Do we see Jedha and Project Cross Zone? Anyway, what is a dweller of said lands doing here? Maybe they just moved. I hope it's that simple. I don't know, but it troubles me. I hope th that they aren't connected. Man, how many does that make? What fearsome foes. I need a plan. Oh, who, who is this? Oh, this looks like an Astaroth or something. Hmm, what mighty magic is this? 
How could there be a being with this power? The bigger, the harder they are to beat, huh? I think the bigger they are, the harder they fall, is what you're trying to say, Xiao Mu? Don't relax. Something is amiss. What? This magic? I see! It's him! Of course, Arthur would recognize us throughout the any <laughs> drop of the hat. <laughs> Sagato そしてなに。Though struck down a million of times, I will not fall. What do you think I went through when I came here? You refer to the past. Now we are stronger. There's a little bit more growth than that. Let's try this. <laughs> There's no mistake. He's the demon Astaroth. <laughs> no kidding, man. No way. He's one of the top-notch baddies. I never expected him to appear. A bit surprising, but also a chance for us to take him on. Or take on him? I don't know which one I want me to say. I wish to ask you something before I strike you down. You and Jiraga are allied, right? <laughs> I needed to say a word. Jiraga is a useful... pawn. <laughs> I suppose Jiraga thinks the same after seeing his tower rise in here. I will not talk more. Why did you allow to be... Why did you allow to be the Genji's clan in your lands? Wow, the English translation. Uh, fan-made translation. <laughs> you do know about that, I trust. Oh yes, them. Those plans are dragons. I know of them not. Then what about the Soul Edge? We already know that it is here. Don't tell me you grabbed it and hit it. 
A sledge? I know nothing of this. Yes, you don't know nothing. Yeah, clearly, he seems now interested in grabbing it for himself. I would imagine. I was all ready for some dramatic speech. Too bad. You should know something. Why doesn't he have details? Huh? What do you mean? He means that someone titled Lord ought to know a bit more than that. Trivial matters are best left to the underlings. Ugh. All leaders are like that. But Hihachi... When fellow members of an organization cooperate, better results come. Don't you think that it's a little odd that their leader doesn't know a thing? I see. In that sense, he is an incompetent, or someone else owns that information. I'm having trouble following this. <laughs> it's easy to follow. That monster knows far too little for someone called the Lord. Either he's simply airheaded, or... This is bad. We've got to beat him again! Or, oh, question mark. We gotta beat, we've got to beat him again? Uh, this chatter ends here. I didn't come here to run you, your mouths. I didn't come to hear you run your mouths. That's what he says. <laughs> oh, now Red Armor Joker is joining. Lord Astra, I shall help you. But why? <laughs> I need my fun too. Well, Is that his reason? He should be here. And what is this disconnect I sense in my lord? You mean discontent or dis something? I don't know. Why did Lord Astaroth appear? Even if he's confident... Confident his power, he shouldn't leave this treasure room. Man. Besides, what Heihachi said troubles me. Well, it looks like that conversation is over. Uh, <laughs> sorry if it took a little long. I had to figure out how long I needed to do, it, do things on on the on the capture of the game. I had to figure out how long things were to say things. And I guess I overcompensated for that time. <laughs> oh well. I hope I hope you guys still enjoy the gameplay. All right, we need to get on the defensive. Oh gosh. So he shoots fire out of his face? Probably has eyeballs. 
Oh, red armage, okay. Stop it! Eh! It's been a long time since I heard his voice over. Alright. Okay, you're going after Krino and Sabine. Um, I don't think we need, really need to do anything. Let's just go after our defense. He is... Well, we, I guess we could have made two. Okay. Well, <laughs> all, here we are with Morgan and Lilith, and they need help. But I think it's time for us to end the episode off here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And remember that Game of Fusion empowers your gaming, and we'll catch you in the next episode of Namco Cross Capcom. Bye for now. I don't even know what's going on anymore. Strider! This.